how about I hope that. is there any news on dedicated servers that's the one that I want to hear about <laughs> well <laughs> you know that's always going to be a, a, a tricky question um I'm not going to lie, man. It looks like early disappointment. We all know how it's been throughout the years. It's always been a disappointment to the point where we just ignore Call of Duty from a certain point on. Like, we don't even pay attention to Call of Duty anymore. I think the last time we probably looked at it and thought that there was some potential was World War II, Call of Duty World War II, until we saw it. Once we saw what that was, it was like, nah, nah. And so we just ignored it since. And now here's, you know, Modern Warfare. So if you're going back to the core, I would love that they do two things. I would love that they have matchmaking as well as dedicated servers, both. Sure. I want them sure. to have both because then it will stop complaints, you know, for people that don't really understand what dedicated servers are all about and vice versa for those who just they don't want to actually look in the list and find one of their favorite servers or whatever they just want to go in a match make it hop on and start playing you know so uh i think if they did add dedicated servers back this would be probably the biggest game to re this would be the game the most important game to revitalize the uh the pc community when you're talking about playing uh, multiplayer getting the clans back together and things like that i know there are other games i'm just saying on a larger scale modern warfare would be the one to kick it off you know because everybody loves the modern warfare series it doesn't matter what series you go to everybody loves the modern warfare series it is the highest selling series of call of duty yeah Hello viewers, don't forget to like this video, comment on it below, share it with others, and most of all, subscribe. We hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. It's too big.